Hello, welcome to Eurodrama. I'm Hannes. I'm Albert. And today we're gonna listen to one of the competing entries for uh, the Finnish national final, Uden Musikin Kilpailu. Wow. Yeah. How did you know that? No, I I, I trained. I, okay. I, I did some training to pronounce that. Okay, and who is well not returning, but who is participating this year? Who is participating? Yeah. The Erasmus. We all know the Erasmus from from our like teenage time. At least yeah. me, who well, yeah. I'm a bit older, maybe. I also and know them, that so. hit in the shadows. That was a worldwide hit, actually. So I was super surprised when I just found out that they are going to to participate in the. Uh, how did how did you call that? Uden Musikin Kilpai. Uden Musikin Dikling. And they're gonna sing. You pronounce it better, yeah. probably as well. well. I think Jezebel. I think I, that's just the yes. name. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, I'm very excited to see how. The song will be. Yeah, me too. So let's get into this. Let's get into this. Mm -hmm. Okay. Of course, we're gonna have some rock here again. Yeah, I wasn't expecting anything else. Yeah, can it really feel like the Rasmus flavor, no? In yeah. It? They have been together since 1994, oh, really? before, yeah, oh, wow. very long time. Yeah. He still has like the, the feathers in his hair, like he used to. And it's a pretty cool little video, no? Power! Yeah. Yeah, it reminds me a lot of the music from the 2000s, no? It does, yeah, they stay true to themselves. Ooh. Okay, the chorus is catchy. It builds up very nicely as well. Yeah. They didn't take very long to get to the chorus again, which is the most like powerful yeah. part, which I like. Yeah, because the verses they bore me a bit, but the chorus is good. It's catchy. Yeah, it's very catchy. It's, it's already in my mind. Yeah, I mean, like, yeah. I saw last year, Finland really knows how to do good rock music. Yeah. And that's a proof again. And also, this is what we expect from Finland. Absolutely. And from the Rasmus. Yeah. With Bridge. Oh, this mm -hmm. score is very, very addictive. Yeah. This is the kind of song you can have on repeat. Yeah. And not get bored of it because it's so catchy. Who is Jezebel? I would That's love to know question. who Jezebel Okay, okay. Yeah, that, that, that was, was very that cool. Was cool. That, that was, was very cool. cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. First of all, I'm super surprised that they're even trying to go to Eurovision and also the fact that they are willing to go to a national final. That like is, well, I have to say that's something very like good. Because yeah. that, that proves that well-known bands they want to go to Eurovision. I think Maneskin, yeah. or the fact that Maneskin won last year, like put Eurovision in a higher level yes. in a way. So I think, I don't know if this year, but in the following years, we'll have like more famous bands or, or singers in general willing to, to go to Eurovision and participate yeah. because, mm, I mean, Maneskin has been super successful in the charts and Spotify. Mm -hmm. They have been like having hits during the whole year yeah. so yeah as a song I mean it doesn't like have or it doesn't give us anything new in a way no it doesn't it's not something yeah. we have never listened to but do to. we always have to have something new that's the question exactly like, if this band they have been a lot, uh, around for so long they know how to make their mm -hmm. music so I'm not really expecting from them to come up with something completely new that I was not expecting from them. This is what I was expecting. Mm -hmm. And they delivered with a good song, with a catchy chorus. And yeah, that's just all that I wanted from the Rasmus. Yeah. My only concern though, is that we already had rock last year. I mean, doesn't mean that rock can yeah. not win again. Of course, rock mm -hmm. can win again. But maybe I would like something more out of the box, like to, yeah. to win Eurovision or to mm -hmm. participate from Finland. It is the first song we, we listen from Finland, so I don't yeah. know about the rest. But yeah, that's a safe choice, but at the same time it's pleasant that the chorus is very catchy. Mm -hmm. And again, the Rasmus is a very, very well-known band, so this will add some points. 
yeah. for them, yeah. And also, I think the fact that Blind Channel last year did so well maybe also triggered the Rasmus to, uh, to take part. All right, then. So this has been our reaction to the Rasmus with their song Jezebel. And remember, if you like our content, we're go gonna kindly ask you to subscribe to our channel. And we also have an Instagram account, so if you wanna see more of us, go here, please. And see you next day in Eurodrama! Eurodrama!